one thing I love about you is you talk about you know having one at bat. You get one life, like make yes. it make it make it real. A lot of people, you know, coming out of school, going to their first job. Another quote you have is like people want to be you know promoted immediately. People want to move too fast. Like, what advice do you have to them, the millennial seller coming into the seat? to go out and kill it. Like, you, you obviously aren't gonna be handed anything. What do you, what do you yeah, tell I mean, that person? Look, you look, I wanna have the real talk, right? Which is like, look, when people razz on you guys, they're wrong, right? They're wrong. When they're like, you're just a kid, millennial, blah, blah, they're wrong. But you're also wrong if you, and not just millennials, anybody, if you expect anything. Like, nobody gives a fuck that you were the captain of your lacrosse team. The fuck does that have to do with anything? Like, you're at zero. Like you're literally at zero. You're 22 years old and you're at zero, right? Like people tell me like, oh this, I'm like, dude, that would mean every number one pick in every single draft went on to become the best player of all time. I'm like, cool, I'm very glad that you were the head of your sorority, Susan, and that you've got real leadership skills. Mazel tov. Now go fucking sell a couple things, show me. So my advice for the kids, since you position it that way, is shut your fucking mouth and execute for 18 months and then stick it to everybody. That's what I did. I want to remind all the kids, I didn't say a fucking word to the world for the first fucking 10 years of my life. You gotta do it first. Put my head down, I built a liquor store. Then I came out and said, I built this business. That's a lot more fun. I have no interest in what you're gonna do. Everybody's gonna do. Every person I've ever met told me they're gonna.